Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Di Honorable My Examiner Ibu Reni Haryanti SSM HUM Bapak Raden Muhammad Ali SPD MPD And Ibu Dr. Sri Wahyuni SSM HUM MA Dan juga My Supervisor Bapak Dr. Mukhlas Abrar SSM HUM Dan Bapak Robi Soma SPD MPD Today in this occasion, I would like to present my thesis with title An Analysis of Speaking Problems Faced by Students During Proposal Seminar at One Public University in Jambi But before that, I would like to introduce myself My name is Gusti Asmarani with students number A1B21814 Okay, let me start it Okay, chapter 1 is introduction Next background of the study Common question which often appears from anyone who wants to know someone's ability in English is whether he or she can speak English or not. Then, the existence of COVID-19 virus has a huge impact extraordinary in education, which makes the learning process change from on- on- offline to uh, online learning. Then, most universities require their students to study research as a requirement to get a bachelor's degree. Then, before presenting the thesis examination, one of the steps that students do is thesis proposal seminar, which functions is to give general information about the thesis. Next is research purposes. There are two purposes of um, this research. The first is uh, researcher want to find out the speaking problems faced by students in research proposal seminar presentation and the second is to find out student strategies in dealing with uh, speaking problems during presentations in proposal seminar next is limitation so the limitation of the research are first completed a proposal seminars so here uh, the researcher limited that the participants is only the students who completed um, the proposal seminar and the second is a researcher focus on the online proposal seminar presentation definition of key terms there are four key terms of speaking problems proposal seminar and strategies move to chapter 2 review of literature Okay, so um, this chapter is contains of several issues and theories that related to speaking problems in proposal seminar. Um, there are five issues: uh, speaking proposal seminar, speaking problem in proposal seminar, strategies to solve the problem, and then previous study. Move to another chapter, chapter three methodology. So in this chapter 3 is uh, consists of research design, participants of the research, data collection technique, data analyzing technique, and then trustworthiness and ethical um, consideration. First is research design. So the researcher use a qualitative research. According to Creswell 2007, qualitative research is a um, means for exploring and understanding the meaning individuals or group described to a social or human problem and also the researcher used the case study approach here next is participants of the research there are uh, eight participants which criteria the first one is students of english education um, in one public university in jambi and then the second is students who have completed a proposal seminar and next is data collection technique in this research Researcher use interview technique to collecting the data. Next is data analyzing technique. The researcher use qualitative analysis technique to analyzing the data, which consists of uh, data reduction, data display, conclusion driving, and verification. In the data redu- reduction refers to the process of selecting, focusing, um, simplifying, abstracting, and transforming the data that appear in written up field note or transcriptions. And next, in data display goes a step beyond um, from data reduction the, uh, the to provide an organized, compressed assembly to, of information that uh, permits conclusions um, driving and the last is in the conclusion and conclusion driving and verification this is the final uh, step of analytical activities for qualitative research here the students will um, try to draw the conclusion and verify by looking for the meaning of each symptom derived from the field 
and for fast worthiness and ethical consideration, here the researcher used member checking. Next is chapter 4, findings and discussion. First is finding. So, um, based on the research question, the research finding consists of two main points. And the first uh, research question is what are the problems faced by students during proposal seminar? And the second question is focus on the student strategies to overcome the problems. First one, focus on difficulties or problems faced by students. There are three themes that students get in the research. First one is linguistics, and second one is psychological, and then environmental. In the linguistic, um, there are vocabulary problem, grammar problem, and pronunciation program problem. In the psychological, there are anxiety and lack of confidence. And in environmental, there are negative response from others and lack of recreation. And the last is indirect connection. Next, um, participant strategies to solve the problem. There are three teams of strategies the researcher found and then the view. There are focus on grammar, focus on vocabulary, and practice and prepare. In focus on grammar, there are sub themes improve your grammar skill by learning the structure of English, such as sentence form, and then be calm and focused when answering, and do not speak too fast. Take it slowly as long as you understand, and just use simple sentences, but the grammar can be used well and can be understood. And then, um, focus and vocabulary. There are several themes, such as um, you can find under you can underline the typical word, practice speaking a lot in, in front of mirror, and then choose a suitable vocabulary and easy vocabulary to use while speaking. For practice and prepare, there are several sub themes, from such as practice communicating with other people, then prepare questions that might might appear during the question and answer session, study and take notes on the points that will be asked, and improve more grammar and vocabulary, try to master the material for each chapter, and then practice asking and answering question, and a little lot of easy part and play. Next is the discussion. So here the researcher um, will discuss based on the research question um, what problems are faced by students in speaking during proposal seminar presentation. There are linguistic problem, psychological problem, and environmental problem. So here, based on these uh, three things, the researcher are uh, include them became the most uh, popular problem faced by students in um, speaking. For linguistic problem, there are grammar. There are four four participants from eight participants who have problem with grammar, and the um, psychological problem and theory. There are four participants and environmental problem. There are lack of preparation with two participants, and also student strategies. There are um, focus on grammar, focus on vocabulary, and practice and prepare. Focus on grammar. Um, the finding of this research turned out of support um, with research conducted by Vinanti 2020. In her studies, showed that students have various strategies to overcome their difficulties in grammar, such as asking people, reading some books, and even watching movies. Next, focus on vocabulary. So, this um, finding of this research turned out to support Hauna 2009 in her study showed that um, most students say that they had a little vocabulary to solve the problem so students um, memorize their vocabulary and often use a dictionary if they encounter a new difficult word so their vocabulary will increase and next is practice and be prepared so um, this uh, these findings supported by another study connected by Herr Nisa 2020 that um, states uh, students do the practice by recording and taking video to see their presentation. So every student hopes that the presentation will be successful in not only in the presenting the material but also in answering questions from participants and examiners. And then next chapter is conclusion and suggestion. 
first is conclusion. So the researcher concluded that there were eight challenges encountered by students such as vocabulary, grammar, pronunciation, anxiety, lack of confidence, negative response from others, and lack of preparation. And the most challenges faced by students were grammar and anxiety. Other than that, the researcher concluded that students have um, some potential solutions to handle or reduce their problems. There were 10 strategies applied by students including input grammar skill and mastered um, 16 tenses in grammar, calm and focused when answering, and do not speak too fast, take it slowly as long as you understand, and just simple, uh, just use simple sentence, but the grammar can be used well and can be understood. And underline the difficult word, practice speaking a lot in front, of, uh, in front of the mirror, choose a suitable and easy vocabulary, practice with other people, and um, prepare the question that might appear during the question and answer session, and then take notes on the points that will be asked with a lot of easy part and pray. So often, uh, strategies improve grammar skill and practice speaking with others in front of the mirror was the most strategy used by students. And then suggestion. So from the conclusion mentioned above, the researcher finally proposed some suggestions. It is important to suggest that English students should be able to familiarize themselves with um, speaking English or practice their speaking skills. With practice, they can develop their speaking skills well. Moreover, students should be able to um, manage themselves in developing their speaking skills to successfully uh, speak English and handle their problems. And for the researcher, since this um, research only utilizes interview method as the data collection, it is suggested that the next researchers who are interested in conducting the same or similar research topic about student speaking problems can use other data collection techniques, such as focus group discussion and then um, audio diary. Thank you so much for your attention and forgive me if there is a mistake. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.